Hello, I am Monica. Before summer overwhelms us with its heat, or winter with its cold if you live in the southern hemisphere, we're releasing a new version of OpenZava, the most robust and secure one you can imagine. OpenZava 7.5.3 is a maintenance release where the most important changes are bug fixes. Additionally, we have updated some third-party libraries, made some small improvements, and worked on the documentation. It's worth updating. There are no compatibility issues with the previous version, and our application will be more secure and robust. This time there aren't many improvements, except that we've added new translations for common word labels in several languages. This makes automatic translation more effective. We have updated the dependencies for the embedded Tomcat, Groovy in Jersey. Additionally, we have also updated the JDBC driver version for Postgres, AS400, DB2 and Firebird use in the documentation and in the palm.xml of new projects. Regarding the documentation, we've improved several parts of the reference guide, especially the sections related to layout and reference customization, adding more code examples, screenshots, and extra explanations. This version also includes a video tutorial that explains how to add a calendar module to your application. And we'll finish with the most important part, the bugs. We've fixed several serious security vulnerabilities. There are also many other valuable fixes, such as the removal of warnings when generating PDFs, unnecessary data change warning messages, overly wide default columns in list view, and more. To update to the latest version of OpenZava, you don't need to download OpenZava Studio again. In fact, you don't need to download anything at all. All you have to do is change the version number in the palm.xml of your projects. Let's take a look. Open your project's palm.xml file. In the openzava.version entry write 7.5.3 and save. On the project choose run as Maven Clean. Then go to run as and choose Maven install. Wait a moment. And your project is already upgraded to 7.5.3 and ready to run. Moreover, from now on, when you create a new project from OpenZava Studio, it will default to version 7.5.3, without you having to configure anything. OpenZava Studio always uses the latest available version for new projects. To know all the details, I recommend checking the full announcement on the openxava.org blog. In the video description, you will find the direct link. Bye.